Hi, my name is Alan Prost and I'm going to present for you today in a short video an alternative to using the light board. Now, the light board is a great tool. There's no question about that. Um, it's, uh, it's quick, it's interactive, it's effective with your audience. Um, it's really nice sometimes to have the, the instructor standing in front of you and being able to write right on top of the uh, screen as the light board allows you to do. And today I'm just going to show you a little bit of an alternative to that. And the reason I'm showing you the alternative is because it allows you maybe to use your PowerPoint. Um, you might not have the equipment for the light board, so you don't uh, need some of that equipment. It's still quick and effective. It's still uh, interactive um, in that you can see me writing on the PowerPoint. Um, but it does allow a little bit more freedom because you can actually use your PowerPoint. You can actually do free writing, as I'm demonstrating for you now, and you can put a lot more specific types of images in your presentation. So the free writing tool is kind of cool because um, I can write just like I do on the uh, whiteboard or the uh, lightboard. So this is nice because you can capture uh, elements in real time just like you would for on the light board. That can be really interesting to do. You saw I can flick back and forth a little bit between my slides. It's something that you can't do with the whiteboard. Also, I've got a more uh, range of types of um, writing and presentations that I could do. At least, that's a thought. All right. So let's go now and see what we have on our next page. And see, you can add images a little bit more easily with uh, using PowerPoint like I'm doing here. And I'm just going to show you, I'm just activating the, the, the laser pointer so you can see I can draw attention to different elements in the pictures. Um, I can also uh, draw on them if I, if I wished, such as like I'm doing right now, if you wanted to talk about specific types of equipment. So it gives you a little bit more range when you can have that PowerPoint and images in my, uh, in my estimation. Now I am having to look down to my PowerPoint. So, a big question that I do have about using the light uh, board or this type of presentation is do you need to see the instructor? Am I really needed as part of the visualization? Do you need to see me uh, scrambling around here to write on the slide and do those other elements? Now, um, when you're using an alternative to light board, you've got to have specific types of equipment. You've got to have a video camera like like a light board. You need to have a computer. I'm using um, an interactive tablet here. Uh, you need specific knowledge about how to use um, an editor and that can be a little bit of a hindrance. So what are some of the pros about using something like a, uh, a light board? All right? It's quick. It's easy. Um, it does uh, this when you use the alternative you don't need a special room and that's one of the things you need with a light board you gotta have a special room right now I'm just in a classroom you don't need that special light board equipment some of the cons is that um, you gotta have uh, video editing capability and that can be problematic not everybody has that they might not have the equipment or the expertise or they just don't feel comfortable learning that there's a lot of really simple to use video editors out there that would give you this capability all right. Um, one of the cons or the downsides of both types of using a light board or this type of presentation is something you might have seen in this short video is that I misspeak. I have to look down to look at my notes. I have to uh, write interactively so that requires me to be cognizant in the moment not just aware that I'm trying to convey specific information but I have to write it at the same time. There's lots of different ways we could do those same types of things. So I recommend actually uh, using voiceovers while you're doing your PowerPoint or something else where you might not see the instructor like you do with Lightboard or as I'm presenting today. But maybe the benefit is you might not be able to, uh, you might be able to correct some of your misspeakings like I just did there or your errors you make as you're writing on your, on your device. Okay, so that's my thought uh, right now and today about um, using a uh, light board. Just to demonstrate for you that there are some alternatives using just a simple video camera and overlaying your PowerPoint or some other kind of uh, screen capture from your computer onto your 
videos. Thank you very much. I'm Alan Prose.